Since your friend hit you fine Dying to tell you how I feel Before you go You know that I'm begging you to stay She is looking so British. <laughs> I say British, but I, have y'all noticed, like I've noticed people here and actually I guess I've been seeing it a lot. So I actually think it's kind of cute, you know, but these really matchy matchy, um, like jumper, what you call things. This honestly, believe it or not, I didn't buy this together. These are the Whitney Simmons Gymshark leggings, which are still some of my favorite to this day. So soft and comfortable. And they just so happened to match with the this green um, crew neck sweater that I had. So I was like, you know what? I didn't like these London people with my little matchy matchy outfits. I actually think it's kind of cute. I'm not gonna lie, I think it's kind of cute. But yeah, we're gonna head out to work. I have my lunch packed. Breakfast, I'm just doing protein coffee to have on the go. Um, and yeah. I feel like this is the earliest I've gotten up in a long time. I mean, it's 9 a.m. and I'm awake and ready. I put on makeup, my hair, like, come on. I gotta, it feels nice. It really feels nice. Um, oh my God, by the way, I signed up to get some driving lessons. When you're here as an American, you can use your American driving license for up to a year before you have to get a British one. But I just, I don't even know how to drive on this side of the road. The signs are different, that kind of stuff. So I'm excited. I signed up, I signed up for lessons. They start next Sunday. So we'll see how that goes. And then like, it'll be so cool just to have that freedom being able to drive, you know? But anyway. Said hello. The moment your friend hits your phone. Dying to tell. Just got here in the office and it's kind of warm and it's such a lovely day. I opened the door to, you know, get some air. Why did the biggest fly come up and, can you hear it? Oh my God. <laughs> I don't even, it, it sounds like a horse fly. I don't even want to get up and find it. See, I'm afraid I'm gonna walk over here and messes up Patricia's setup. <laughs> like, I don't want to mess up her filming. I'm gonna start swinging at the fly and then Oh my God, I, I saw it. It's not a, it's it's like a bee. It's like a big old freaking June bug or a black bee. Oh, oh my God, you see it on the floor? Do you see that thing on the floor? Oh, it's like a beetle. That's a bee. Do you see that thing crying? Oh, it's massive. How do I help it get out? Oh, or kill it or something. <laughs> He's right there. I don't know if you can see so close to the door and I'm kind of terrified. I kind of want to scooch him towards the door, but then I feel like he's gonna like fly and sting me or something. I don't know, I'm just so scared. You know that I'm begging you to stay. Just doing some editing in house. Um, finishing this video for her today. And then there's a vlog and we leave super, super soon. So yay. about to catch the bus it's gonna be coming any minute now so so I keep this short we're headed straight to the gym um, ate my lunch it was delicious oh my god so good but I probably should have packed more fruit or another snack but you know oh my bus is here okay right. <laughs> my trainer 15 minutes almost done for this machine a lot of jump rope what else? I don't know. <laughs> baby, you know it. You're losing patience with me, but baby, don't show it. Ooh. Isn't this what you wanted? But you're blowing up my phone because I didn't come crying to you. So come on, ask me. You can waste your breath, I won't waste mine Cause it's 
finished it's really late in the day i'm just not picking up the camera it's like 2 p.m um and i just finished doing my skincare hence a little bit of shine i'm going to a dermatologist today and i'm really excited i've never in my life once been to a dermatologist um i mean i never really had a reason to i haven't i haven't had trouble with my skin like ever of course when i was younger you know i get uh, pimples and stuff I never had an acne problem though and even now I still break out you guys have seen I get a lot of blackheads I have this thing on my nose right here oh my god I still got stuff in my face from when I washed it Ugh, like little cleaning beads <laughs> I have this little dot here that I hate it's just ugh, I don't know but um I'm going to a dermatologist simply you know to learn more about my skin and you know it's looking to like getting facial pills and just you know microdermabrasion brasion <laughs> and different things that I've heard about that I know will be good just for aging for preventative measure measures because yeah I've been really getting into my skin especially you know as I'm getting older and I don't like I said have any issue other than this thing I'm trying to get rid of right here this little sucker I don't have like a bunch of issues or anything like that at all but this is just maintenance honestly and i'm trying to be bougie all right my best life i got the money why not if i want to go to the dermatologist regularly to look my best i will <laughs> and yeah honestly glow up right glow up year 2020 and um skin is a major part of that especially because i'm not big on heavy makeup and i just want to have a fresh face and you got to have a fresh face to have a fresh face okay Hey you guys, we just got back from the dermatologist. Sorry, it was literally, it was a long commute back. Um, and I actually spent it enjoying this podcast, which is called Enjoy the Podcast. Absolutely love it. It's a really good episode, you should check it out. But yeah, the dermatologist appointment went so well. I'm really happy I went. I really like the doctor that I spoke to. Um, and yeah, basically, long story short, she recommended a different retinol brand for me to use because the one I was using, which was the Ordinary, wasn't really doing anything to my face. So she recommended me another one to try. I got this retinol and hopefully it does something to my face because right now I'm using the Ordinary and I went from their weakest strength to their strongest strength and absolutely nothing like I feel like my skin is like the texture of a foot so <laughs> nothing is penetrating it and then these oil control pads so I'm gonna add this into what I'm already doing she was saying um I have a lot of clogged pores here in this area and then I you know I was talking to her about different procedures because I'm interested in like just having like a monthly maintenance routine or something where I can go and get procedures done you know anti-aging clear my skin, better texture. Um, yeah, so we talked about my options and what she would recommend for me, which she really just recommended micro needling, but it's gonna be a couple weeks before I try it, but yeah. <laughs> 